Well, here I am with Maureen. Maureen is the director of the Yachty Gras, and we're starting early this year, aren't we? Yes. For a great celebration of Yachty Gras. And Yachty Gras is sort of the Bay Area's uh, answer. It's a Texas Mardi Gras celebration. And uh, Maureen, tell us a little bit about it. I know you and I were on the be in the beginnings and started this with uh, Olson and getting it started. And uh, tell us a little bit about the history. Yachty Gras started in uh, 2002 for me. I came on board as the executive director in 2002, and we have evolved over these years, and now we're soon to be 10 years into it when we hit 2012. Uh, we will, this will be our 11th anniversary next year, and we are in the process right now of working on uh, sponsorships and volunteer base. We start at this point and they come in and um, then we're able to put them on our websites where we put them on all of our advertisements so right well it's such a unique event i mean you've got to come and see it i mean to participate in it either as a volunteer or sponsor or just a reveler i mean it's something so unique to uh this area it is again like i said it's done celebrate during the uh, mardi gras time period but it's our own twist We've got a wonderful boat parade where we throw beads to the boardwalk and we have a parade of 50 to maybe 100 boats this year that we'd like to have uh, as far as part of the parade up and down the, um, the boardwalk. And also we've got the kickoff party that's coming up right in uh, December. Uh, the dates for uh, the main event will be March the 4th will be our big sponsorship kickoff party where we um, do a lot of uh, benefit for our sponsors and then on Saturday morning will be the skippers meeting at 10 o'clock at Sundance Grill and then at uh, 6 p.m. we have a judges party and all the judges come to Outriggers and at that point they get set up and then the boat parade starts at 7 p.m. that night and it is just fantastic because people come from um, 150, 200, 300 yes. miles radius to this event. Everything is packed. There are at least 10 to 20 people deep on the uh, boardwalk for people to Right, meet. and what I like the most is the party beforehand. Yes. This is a wonderful party we had last year, Lady D and the Zydeco Tornadoes, which was fabulous, authentic uh, Zydeco band from Louisiana yes. and the food was just oh my goodness it was incredible it's all authentic Louisiana Cajun cuisine everything from boudin to shrimp etouffee to you name it great desserts baby cake and even the beer a beat of beer made in Louisiana was a small sponsor last year so we welcome everyone to come out and celebrate this year's Yachty Gras so either be a sponsor be a donor, be a volunteer, or come out and be a reveler, right? That's right. And, uh, bring your boat. And the best part about it, it's not a she-she ball. You don't have to rent your tux. And sometimes the weather can be 80 degrees in February. So we want you to be comfortable, but everyone's welcome to wear a mask <laughs> and come out and have some fun. So, uh, Maria, it's always a pleasure to see you. Well, and thank what's you. the dates again? March the 4th, 5th, and 6th. Great. And uh, how can they get more information? What you need to do is call 713-882-4040 or go online to yachtygraw.com. That is our website. And you can pull up all the information about all the events. So let's lay bon ton roulette. Let's all have fun on Yahoo, right? <laughs>